So the city council has decided that the spirit of Pawnee should be changed to something just a little less horrifying. Now, since the murals were made by government employees back in the 1930s, we thought it might be fun if each department submitted the design for a new mural. And you'll submit your concepts tomorrow afternoon. All righty, folks. Thank you very much. Hey, Leslie, what's your design going to be? Tree? Joe, you work in sewage. Your department literally specializes in crap. You really want to do this? I told you before, crap is a slang term, and I don't like that term. But at least we don't specialize in losing like you guys. Sewage, let's roll. Damn, how does sewage always get the hottest interns? Please be April. April? Yeah? It's Joe. From the phone, I made you laugh. You said come down. Listen, my van's out back. Let's Ew. roll. No, no, please leave. Where are you going? Hey, what's up? Is this guy bothering you? No, I'm bothering you for bothering her. Are you her bodyguard? I mean, she's an adult. I think she can decide on her own what train she wants to ride. It's time to go. Whatever, man. I work for the sewage department. I'm up to my waist in hot snacks. Take a walk. Bye-bye. Don't freak out, but Joe from Sewage just unhooked your bra with his eyes. What? Oh, boy. Hi, Joe. What's up, Nope? Looking good these days. What do you say? Band's out back. Let's roll. Where is this coming from? I don't know. You're putting out some vibe today. It's just driving me crazy. Listen, if you're looking for a good time, why don't you come on down to the toilet party? That's what we call the sewage department. Great. OK. Liking the view. Still got it, Joe. No, you don't. I heard you were giving out free money. I need $3,000 minimum. Mr. Fandringham, the city of Pawnee is not going to give you a personal loan. What would you do if one of your citizens was about to come into some serious physical harm, unless he got $3,000? I'd call the police. You cannot call the police. Hey, nope. How's life in the parks department? Better than life in the sewage department, which makes more sense. Whatever. You guys are screwed. Get used to this. Because it's going to be hanging on the wall right outside your door for the next 100 years. What's up? What's wrong with me? Why do good guys hate me and gross guys love me? Diagnose me, you're a nurse. There's nothing wrong with you. You're an intelligent, classy, attractive woman. But for whatever reason right now, only douchey guys are buying what you're selling. So I should go and ask them what they think I'm selling. A douche vestigation. Nice. Hi, Joe. I know you're gonna take this the wrong way, but can I talk to you for a second? You can do anything to me for any number of seconds. Hmm. Would you like to talk outside my van? No, here's fine. I was flattered by what you said earlier. And I was just wondering, what do you look for in a woman? She can't be in a wheelchair. No canes, no gray hair. So basically, you're just attracted to me because I'm not an elderly person. Yeah. And as I aforementioned, you have a killer dumpster. God, who keeps emailing me? Penis. What? Oh my God. Oh. It's emailing me too. Whoever this is, send it to every woman in the entire government. Oh my God. He's gonna be so embarrassed. I mean, that's a crazy accident. No, Andy, he did it on purpose. You know what? Respect. That's a baller move. Pun intended. Excuse me. Chris, Jerry's making us look at dirty pictures on his computer. It is exactly because of that lewd photo that I am here. Ben and I are launching a full investigation. I want to apologize to all the women and Jerry. If I could go back in time and cut your eyeballs out, I would. Wow, that is so sweet. Thank you. I didn't know who to come to with this, but that picture, uh, there's something very disturbing about the testicles. I've always felt the same way myself. The testicles are like the ears of the genital system. They serve a very important function, but they're not that great to look at. OK. Wow. No, I, I was speaking medically. They're enlarged. I think that maybe that guy is sick with something, perhaps a hernia or mumps. And Perkins, you really know your testes. Thank you.
Joe, I've determined that the lewd picture was sent by you because you sent it from your personal email address, stinkmaster69 at alumni.saralawrencecollege.edu. Really? Sarah Lawrence? Yeah. I wanted a small college experience. You also bragged about it to many of your coworkers. There's an old sewage department saying, if you've got a nice drain pipe, there's no reason to hide it. I doubt that's a saying. We are terminating you effective immediately. Is this because you're jealous? No, it's because you broke the law. The law of having an amazing package. Before we have him forcibly removed, you should know this, that one of our female employees, a nurse, examined the photo you sent her. I bet she did. And you have the mumps. You might want to get that checked. Sweet. Someone's got mumps on his lumps. Up high, anyone? A few days ago in a routine campaign oh. stop in downtown Pawnee, one Leslie Note, pause, was attacked. Play by a pie. Luckily, it only hit Jerry, so no damage was done. Play. The only evidence we have is a video shot by Paws, my wife, April Ludgate. This is Burt Macklin's greatest assignment yet. If you are watching, perpetrator, just know that you are still at large. Sewage Joe. Ben Wyatt fired you for sending pictures of your penis to everyone, and you've come here to pie him. Little twerp has it coming. Oh, dude, I dare you. Please, give me one reason to take you down. I would love nothing more. Oh, f Ben, sorry. All right, let's go. Oh, I did it. Yeah, great job. Let me just get some details for your file. Now, are you two a couple? No, tragically, we are both heterosexual. <laughs> so, and what are you looking for in particular? Some sperm? I meant in terms of a donor. Oh, you know, nice guy, nice sperm. Flip to this binder, make a note of anyone who interests you, and I'll be back shortly. Oh, this guy went to Harvard. So did the Unabomber. This guy seems healthy, loves cycling. Yes, so did Lance Armstrong, and he turned out to be a lying drug user. Or a hero, I don't know where we stand on him now. Hello, ladies. Fancy meeting you here. Whoa, sewage Joe. Wow, and you remember Joe Fantringham. He is the gentleman who was fired for emailing a picture of his penis to every woman in City Hall. Guilty. Yeah, that's what the judge said. Mm -hmm. Joe, you are a donor here, huh? Did you hear that, Ann? Big time. Me and all my buddies. Free money, free porn. Best job I ever had. Also, if you're looking to buy some weed, I'm looking as well. Shall we? Yep.